Okay, make sure we're reloaded. Just in case. Hey, we got an airlock here. I'll make this a lot easier to find and get to. Alright, who is this? Zachary West? <laughs> he had udon noodles in his pack. Okay. Ivy, what is it? How's it coming? I, I can't get this damn thing open. Where's Danielle? Still not answering. What's wrong? Danielle tied the lock to her voice. We need her to speak the key phrase or we're not getting in here. Ugh. Do voice samples work? Transcribe recordings? Yes. If they have the right words. Or if we gathered enough to map her voice to a consonant and vowel list and started running patterns. I'll see if I can find her. Or her transcribe. I'll check her room first. All right, Ivy. But look, don't do anything stupid. Okay. Ivy? Ivy? Shit. Damn it, Danielle. Where are you? So I can't get into here unless I have her fucking voice like, God damn it, I hate when this happens. It's unlikely Chief Show is still alive. I advise you follow Zachary West's strategy. Hack together voice samples. Your transcribe is equipped with the necessary software. It's how you made my voice. Danielle's cabin might be a good place to get started. Alright, I guess we're heading to crew quarters. The fuck <laughs> is this? B2! Is this a map? Treasure map for Horden Baffle Flag Dasterus. Huh. Okay, that's a weird one, but we can look around. Oh, you know, we never, uh... There, there were some items on the rooftop of the building. Or of the ground over to the right. I want that stuff. So we're gonna actually head back up to Alex's office. Thank you, tree. How many games have done this now, where you where you need the voice sample in order to get into an area? At least like five, maybe. Hey, how Good you doing? Evening, Talos. Oh. This is a reminder that the identity of guests visiting Talos is strictly confidential. Yesterday's batch was an abysmal failure, piss poor root initiation. However, Dr. Lin from Psychotronics was kind enough to provide me with a sample of material that should multiply the effectiveness of the phytohormones when applied to already mature plants. I expect reduced time to maturity, increased yield, and an above normal salutary effect. Hopefully, it doesn't taste like shit. I just need permission to run the plant through the fabricator. Okay. Dr. Howard's growth formula. He was up here the whole time! Okay, let's go see what this does. I'm curious if it's going to do something beneficial for us at all, or if it'll just be something that we can go, oh, neat. All right, Dr. Howard's growth formula. Ooh, I just have barely enough for this. Uh, it'll toss these in there because I don't care for the spare parts anymore. I mean look at our inventory. I Just want the organic materials or the minerals All right an experimental growth formula developed by Jock Julian Howard intended to increase yield and efficiency Our Fuck it <laughs> My mind wants to say efficiency, but it's not efficiency. It's like efficacy. <laughs> if we slow down efficacy or something, you know, it'd be fine. But we got no time to slow down. We got a lot of time to slow down, but we got no time to slow down. We got to grow plants, guys. We get to literally watch plants grow. Okay. Ooh. Regulates flow of water supply. Customized for Talos 1 plumbing systems. Boy, that sounds fun. Alright. 
Here we go. Let's see what this does. Science! Whoops. Oh! Harvest your fruit after the growth cycle is complete. Is it gonna happen in front of us? Probably not. Alright. We'll just have to come back here later on then. Hello. Should Hello. we say more? Are you here yeah. for an appointment? I'm going to head down to Gargo Bay. Don't want to make Sarah mad. Even if she didn't make it, she'll still find a way to take it out on me. Ha! <laughs> really, Dr. Yu, I'm fine. I just need a moment. I'll take all the time you need. Hello, nice to see you. The cargo bay is kind of in a bad state at the moment anyway. I mean, I cleared out the area in front of it, but it's kind of locked off at the moment. Hello, are you here for an appointment? God, I need a key card for this. Okay. I don't know, there shouldn't be any enemies in front of here. Evening, Talos. A word from our security chief, Ms. Alizar. To protect your co-workers' privacy, security terminals are reserved for authorized uses only. If you're not wearing a blue uniform, you're probably not authorized. Ha! <laughs> Alright. Well, let us head into the crew quarters. Alright, in crew quarters, Transtar employees enjoy numerous amenities, including a fitness center, theater, and the Yellow Tulip Lounge. Employees are assigned either a grand suite, a modest cabin, or an efficient habitation pod according to their role. What is it? What does an efficient habitation pod mean? <laughs> is it gonna be like a capsule hotel? Like in Japan? That'd actually be- that'd be kind of neat. I've always wanted to check something out, and it'd be in space, I mean, it can't be that bad. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. You! I see you! Another puppet! Looking for me with black egg behind your eyes. Come closer. Yes. A little closer. The fuck just happened? <laughs> Guess this is the escape volunteer. What? You too? You want to come into a kitchen? Good. Come. The cook's request. How many? How many bodies do you have, huh? Investigate the the cafeteria. Yeah, all right. Oh. Whoops. That's not the right ability. Ha <laughs> I blew off his fucking head! Completely and utterly. Uh, I want to save these people before they walk in and get themselves killed. I don't know if it's gonna do anything for me, but it'll make me feel better. I see you! Alright. Bye, Jack! It's okay, you can't hurt me! Oh! Shit! Good! Come! Oh fuck, they fucking they blow themselves up on you. Okay, alright. Yeah, I didn't know that was an option. I didn't know that was something they could do. Now I'm uh, a little mortified. Whew. Okay, Patricia Wang. Hey, we think I think we've heard her a couple of times. I knocked everybody out, and I have a fucking save zone to keep on hearing this guy talk. Oh, I was hoping that Indigo Lake was gonna was gonna be conscious after my jagging her back. Send it, send it. When will you stop? Stop! Can't think with all the puppet bombs. I need to deal with the guy in the cafeteria. I really don't need him fucking constantly being like, Ah, oh, things are happening, and we'll blow up everybody. Ooh. 
Pursuant to A, use orders. I have compiled a report concerning Annalise Gallag Gallagos and Associates. Encloses also a suspicious conversation between Will Mitchell and Quentin Purvis to be reviewed by A, you ASAP. <laughs> okay. Uh, I see some Neuromods in there. I can very obviously just hack into this, but maybe there's environmental clues. Yeah, right. It's a level 2 hacking door. I'm fine. I wonder if we'll have a choice to save this guy, or will he be too far gone? I mean, I think he has explosives. That's not good for us. I fucking damn it. Took too long to navigate around that. Lot of puppets, huh? Okay, that went a lot smoother. This now needs to just go straight. And we're fine. Give me the neuromods. And shotgun shells, holy shit. Ah. Three newer mods too, that's really good. Alright. What can I spend that on? I was starting to kind of go this way. Psychotronics 2. Psionic aptitude. Because now we can kind of start digging around. I should probably throw it into gunsmith. Honestly. Being able to... Fully upgrade my weapons would be nice. Okay, so how many weapon kits do we have? We have eight? Good. We're gonna upgrade my shotgun. By a lot. Or at least as much as possible. So we have 79 damage on the shotgun now. Maximum firepower achieved. I can reduce the recoil. If I really wanted to, I could throw every single last one of my upgrade kits at my pistol and my shotgun. Fuck it. <laughs> right now we have a lot of ammo. Having 10 shots for a fight would be awesome. There. The Margrave is now complete. I think. There might be an expansion here, I don't know. But for now, it is full completion there. That makes me pretty happy. And for my pistol, if I upgrade it... Upgrade... I would go for range and accuracy. Uh, accuracy would be really swell. There. Because I, I do feel like your pistol's got really garbage accuracy at the beginning. I mean, it legitimately has 60% or below 60% at the beginning. So, like, if you wanted to deal with a target at a far range, can you? it's a little bit more of a bitch. Although we haven't really tried- I haven't seen if, uh, we can do headshots on phantoms yet. It kind of seems like a pointless goal when they can go so damn fast. Whoa. Uh... Oh shit. That is trouble. Be a star. No, 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 no. I need... this. I could also press 7, but, uh... Come on, Jack 3! I'm fine for now, though. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I, uh, I tried to use my psychic ability on him, 
but he hit me with psychic power first, which completely nullified my abilities. So that's awkward. <laughs> he can do the same shit that I can do to him. So I have to do it to him first. Also, the fucking guy is goddamn talking to us during this. He's giving us good advice, but it's advice I already know. Deal with the damn monsters. Oh, man. How many bodies do you have, huh? Oh. Whoever you are, run. What's that? There is no more. Who are here except you? Steal a hold of your brain. Good. Others here? Or not? Shoot first before they get close. They're puppets. Bombs. The master is close. Kill this. Or puppets. Or bulls. Before they kill you. When no more puppets, maybe we talk. Yep, that's a fair enough request. Okay, we gotta kill the psycho or the uh, telepath. Should be a little bit easier now that I've won, cleared out the area slightly. It's no, huge. Stop talking. No, you're not real. You're not real. All right. I'm ready. Oh. Hold on. Where the fuck did it go? Oh yeah, please do run at me! It'll make this slightly easier. Uh, let's see. Mind Jack. Boom. You can actually mind jack from a pretty far fucking distance, my god. I haven't tried mind jacking a... Something else. No! Fuck you! I'm saving all of them. That's... Fucking... I stunned... I stunned a guy with it before and it worked. But now we know if it's somebody coming after you aggressively, I'm gonna need to mind jack him. That that's all right, fine. That makes me feel a little bit better about grabbing mind jack in the first place. But I was kind of already on that goal. Ugh, I quick saved, last time I quick saved was before I fucking knocked out quite a few of these guys. I'm saving as many people as possible. I want to just shoot the goddamn telepath, but it went all the way up here. Scan all right. The guy lost his head. That's not good for him. Okay. And then we just sneak up and shotgun blast. Ah, kill you with a wrench. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Now oh, this isn't the kitchen's all the way over here. Howdy. Mm, your suit. What is in your name tag? You? Um, am you? Am you? You killed this yourself. Huh. If you want to come in, be safe. You go. Get something of mine, huh? Uh-huh. Here, key. It opens my room. Will Mitchell's cabin. Go there. Get my... award. It's important to me. Then okay. maybe we talk. I don't know what you have to give me, but sure, fine. Close the fucking window. The cook's request. 
Oh, after all I did, I pretty much I dealt with the the psychic in the area, and you're like, yeah, you could still do something for me. Fine, fine, it's fine. All right. Well, I feel better about myself. We saved all the people here. Didn't have them blow up on me. Ugh. I wonder if when they blow up on you, that counts against you. Like, yeah, like as if you pretty much killed them yourself. Ooh, Vincent had... a weapon upgrade get on him. Nice. And I can use that now, so... A uh, pistol. Range. Definitely some of the most important stats for it. Not having my pistol, like, do very low damage at long range is nice. Caleb? We're gonna need to find, um, actually we can just look at the map. I was gonna say, we need to find a recycler as well. Oh, there's a fabricator in that room. Uh, recycler, not seeing one on this level. But there is a recycler on level 2, near the yellow tulip. Mmm. There's a lot of stuff here. Oh, we need to get to Alex Yu's place. Or suite, and my suite. I'd imagine they're both upstairs. <laughs> Maybe they're right across from each other. And we have, like, turrets set up to shoot the other person with, like, real bullets because we don't like each other. We've had some creative differences. Oh. We still have fucking possessed people. <laughs> Didn't expect that. I guess there might be another telepath, or they just aren't all connected to the same person. Ah. How many fucking people are possessed in here? I mean, I'm happy to find this many people alive. Usually when we were looking at things and it would say that they're alive, I kind of just, and we started to scoff at that. We started to go, eh, it probably just means that they're a phantom or some shit. But these guys are legitimately... Still here. Don't worry about power flickering. Still, please just thank you. Keep going. Harvest the super fruit. <laughs> Gary Snow, Oliver. Look, guys, I'll save you all. Get away, get away, get away. It's just gonna require some effort. A lot of effort. <laughs> Remote manipulation. All right, this is gonna suck. So I'm gonna have to mind jack one of these guys, and then like run away. And hope for the best. Because I can't mind jack two people. Uh, not, not within quick succession of each other. Thankfully, it looks like Oliver has slightly forgotten about us. Good. There. Now we can have a nice visit to the fitness center. Ah. Oh, she's she fell down the stairs a little bit. That's not on me. How many people are here? I'm glad that the uh, the typhoon didn't kill them all, though. This would be easy mimic production ground. Real fucking easy. Oh. We got another telepath. And we also got Kinetic Blast 3 because of it. Physical Blast that deals up to 100 damage and pushes away anything within 7 meters of the target area. That one's not so necessary for me. That's actually kind of more annoying than anything. I haven't been using Kinetic Blast because it's 40 power for 50 damage. 
which isn't incredibly worth it, but once we upgrade it a little bit more, it'll be good. One of the problems is that the phantoms fucking like teleport, and it's not an instantaneous blow up effect, so that's kind of annoying. Alright, it has quite a few people around it, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna mind jack all of them, if possible. So I don't have to worry about them getting in the way. How much does it cost, anyways? Uh, 18 to mind jack and combat focus, okay. That's not terrible, it's also just not great. We need to get my neurostimulant stuff up. Because when I use a Psy Hypo and it only gives me 50, ugh. That's terrible. I'm glad this thing doesn't notice that it's losing control of everything. I've lost control of my life, but I just don't notice. Uh, we have to wait for it to turn around. Uh, uh, uh. Go turn around so I can get to you and do a sneak attack. It's the most efficient thing I can do. Sneak attack it, and psycho jack it. Uh... Yeah. We'll leave that guy be. No point in uh, engaging in a fight with this guy. I'm about to take out the thing that's controlling him anyways. At least I hope so. You little fuck. If I throw a towel be up by it. Turn around and fucking stare at it. <laughs> Come back! I have a wrench for ya! Yeah! All right, fine. <laughs> Fucker flies around too fast for me to keep hitting in the face. If only Psyjack can get made it get stuck in place as well. I mean, it's supposed to be a stun, but it doesn't look like it stuns the the telepath. It more like makes it freak out and go, "Oh shit! Things are getting real. I gotta get out of here. All I wanted to do was mind jack people and make them work for me. I don't even." I don't even notice when they- they get knocked out! What I ever do to deserve this? It does make me feel a little bad for it. It's like one of the few enemies that runs away. When shit's not going its way. Everything else just kind of like, gets very aggressive. Okay. Um... There's a window upstairs. I kind of want to go to it. So, we're gonna build ourselves a little path. I'm just trying to figure out the most efficient one. Mm. There's not that many good places to put this. I think we'll just have to make do. Uh, and then if we extend past the wall... That might be decent. Uh, now, nope, dad, damn it. The problem is, you can't stack them. <laughs> I'm sure there have been people like, Oh, you could just stack them up on top of each other. No. No, they bounce. They bounce. Hmm. Ah, they don't do much. Damn it, I might have made it worse. I'm trying to side jump. Because you can climb on top of these things once you place them. This is gonna be a fucking battle. Fine, 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 fine. Obviously, I could just go up the fucking staircase. 
I just wanted to do it in a cooler way. Is this guy still up? No, he's knocked out. Okay, well, let's take everybody's stuff. Lots of vodka in the fitness center's locker room. Maybe not the best place to be drinking, but all right. Uh-oh. Hold on. I might as well dismantle some of these, even though I would like to just- ah, Look at the material yield! Hmm... I will... Drink a wine. And grab it like this. Alright. I need to get a recycler ASAP. Wait, hold on, I can drink from the tap! Although I wouldn't trust anything that's going through these water pipes, that's for sure. Not anymore, at least. Hmm. <sighs> really? Oh, wow. Uh, alright, I guess I'll just have to... Drink the pop star and then pick it up. <laughs> Whoops. Look at the weight room. Now, does this go anywhere? Nope, none of the fans... ...go beyond in the back. I can't break them and go into a hidden tunnel. Oh, well, that, that, alright. <laughs> it's so easy to fling myself off of places. At least with the glide. Okay. Nothing else really here, but we see that area. Okay, how am I gonna do this? I can do this. Damn it. <laughs> I wish to hit the pipe. Hmm. This would actually be an interesting place to come in through first. You run in, and then you kill the Psycho Jack from above, where the minions can't touch you at all! Maybe. But in terms of getting back up, not a full possibility. Hmm. I know it's gonna bug me. Okay. So if I come in from this side, this might work. Please. No. If only my jetpack was actually a little bit better. Like, it would be awesome if it was a little bit of a double jump. Like, not taking fall damage is sweet. But I have, I have other preferences, like not getting blocked off for every fucking pipe. Fine, I give up. You win. I'll find my other way. I'm sure this is just supposed to be an alternate route into this area. Like, say so you climb up over there. Because, yeah, this is a level 4 security door. Okay. Well... We have this whole area to check out. We have tons of cabins. On this floor are places to check out on level 2 and 3. But I haven't been going for 6 hours and I haven't had breakfast yet, so... I'm gonna go do that, and when we get back, we're gonna begin our exploration. Be right back. <laughs>